What's up, YouTube? This is Darnell with Turf Wars Lawn Care. I got a visitor today. Hi. My wife, she with me. We're doing a vlog again. Um, we're heading to Site 1 to get some fertilizer. Pre. texting people um, while I shop. Okay, so I came to get some gloves. I need some gloves. Um, what are you dealing with? Certain things. So we're getting some gloves. Also want to get oh, these only a dollar and I ain't I like to use these as well. If you're starting out, if you go to Lowe's for stuff like this, please, if you got a Harbor Freight around you, please do not go to Lowe's and get these things. Any basic tools, Harbor Freight. All right, so we just left Harbor Freight. Um, Somehow I spent more than what I expected. But, so I got the end. If you shop at Harbor Freight a lot, um, the inside track club is well worth it. I just got it. I, I'm always in here and I, don't, I didn't have the membership to the inside track club, but I already saved 17. I paid 30 bucks for it. And I saved $17 a day, so it's, the membership already paid for itself. Um, yeah, so that was cool. I just bought some gloves. I, I bought a sprayer. Um, another sprayer. And I bought some. trying to vlog turf wars she made this too she make everything she made these shirts you see that the yeah. hat yeah get you a talented wife a talented solo talented girlfriend and, and she's doing all those things then you put the ring on it trying to vlog and I almost ran into somebody so I'm, I'm not looking at the camera I'm sorry uh, safety first when she said something about Ross that's where I'm 
almost lost it. Why would you lose it? So we back home and I got this sprayer and the fertilizer. And so now I gotta unload the trailer. So we're gonna get the mulch. So last night, our um this is an equipment defender V2 blower rack. Um last night. I I've been running this rack for a week, for about a week. And it was unstable. Cause I got a two style type trailer. And uh, so I had to order, I called Quick Center and I had to order the, the mount. So I ordered this mount, put it in last night. I did it the way I wanted to do it. Cause I know it, it wasn't the way it was supposed to be done, but it's pretty sturdy. It was another piece that you put on top. I just did it the way I I need to do it. It's not going anywhere. It's not shaking anymore. So yeah, I did that. And don't have to worry about that. Just gotta thread lock these. Thread lock these in. And that'll be all taken care of. But yeah, I'm gonna unload the trailer and we'll get the mulch. Come back, put the mulch down, hit my neighbor's yard with the mulch. Then I gotta put out some fertilizer. And uh and then I got a yard to cut. So I got a lot to do today. This is our yard. It's greening it up, but got a few spots. And then I got a whole bunch of rye. In the yard. I don't know how that happened. But yeah, I'm gonna go get this mulch. She's um, doing some other stuff. So, this is what it looks like. Dandelions. And a couple of weeds in there. I'm gonna go look at the back. It's a little moist, but should be able to get it good without writing up the yard. I'm not gonna record this. So, it's a lot to do today, so I'm gonna go ahead and knock it out and show you how it looks when we get done.
already does. Got it all done. <clears throat> it was weedy. If you know anything about cutting those weedy yards, if you don't got your, your blades not sharpened, then yeah. I'm gonna struggle. But um, <clears throat> my blades are pretty sharp. Cut, cut everything on the first first pass. Got it back looking nice. I didn't bring, I usually keep glad to say it on me. I would spray it in those beds. It's a pretty good client. So I'm gonna, you know, he tip. So would have been great. A little add on. But yeah, got the one little yard that I need to cut today. Now I'm about to go get some mulch. Whew. Man, it's hot out here now. Um, 70 degrees, but the car inside the car, it's, um, it's pretty, it's giving me flashbacks from, from summertime. So yeah, we got that done. Um, I gotta get back in the groove, man. It took me 40 minutes. I mean, it was weedy, but it wasn't overgrown or nothing. It was just weedy. Um, but y'all know how those weeds go. Um, yeah, man. Gotta get this day back going. Oh, I also, I think I picked this guy up. He sent me a text. The guy across the street, um, I talked with him when I first pulled up. And he was like, how do I do things? And oh, I got lock my trailer. Like I was saying, I picked up, supposedly picked up this guy. I don't know if he's playing around. You know how that goes when people say they want something and then they back out. Yeah, if you out there, you gonna pick up work. Just make sure you look professional and you're doing a good job on your own properties that you are on because that's gonna determine if you know they wanna they wanna use you. But that's it. I'm I'm on to the next mission. What's up, y'all? I'm back. Took a little break. Um, I did put the mulch out in my neighbor's yard. I fixed what I needed to fix. Um, and unfortunately, came into a um, issue with some of my equipment. My trimmer was on this cheap trimmer racks that I bought, and it snapped. The shaft snapped. That's the second time it happened to me. So I gotta order me another shaft and actually replace it or get another weed either. But I'm going for the cheaper option. But yeah, I'm gonna do this and that's it for the day. Well, we gonna do this. We gonna do this. I'm having a snack. She always eat. But yeah, here we go. All right, we're at the last thing for the day, and that is our own project, the mulch bed. All right, to give a little briefing on this mulch bed, she ripped out all the plants that she did have in here. Um, we put in these small shrubs in the back, and we got some flowers in the front, and in the middle, we have perennials that are going to come back from last season, so it will look fuller. Um, I put down some preen that I already had, had the pre-emergent preen. You can get it at Lowe's. Um, also, you can get Snapshot, which is a more heavy duty pre-emergent to put down if you're doing landscaping beds. But 
I don't, I didn't want to put down landscaping fabric. I'm trying to get away from putting that down on organic mulch because weeds are going to come up regardless, but it might hold them off for a while. But weeds can grow on top of mulch. So why waste your time? So I'm trying to, I'm, I'm heading in that direction with most jobs, not putting it down unless someone axes and they really want it down. I did a, a rubber mulch job. That made sense to put it down. And those like rock jobs, they, those make sense as well. So here we're just, um, I'm bringing in the mulch and she's raking it on in and we're getting it done. I'm glad we're finishing up this project because spring rest is on the way, guys. So if you got anything you want to do, do and get it done now because customers are calling and they're demanding you get out on their properties and get them in shape. So I want to keep my clients happy. So if it's anything I need to do at home, I'm going to go ahead and do it now so we can um, have a productive, smooth season you know i ain't gotta go back and say i gotta do this at home i don't got time you know y'all know how i get y'all know how i get when it get it get busy you don't have time to do nothing so yeah that's it wrapping it up and yeah put a little much on the side yep and we out oh that's my sign as well I like to keep a sign so for the neighbors come by and see it, they can call me. I always promote yourself, guys. I always promote yourself. People are watching. I get calls from people walking down the street. All right. Um, I'm gonna probably cut the grass on Sunday. It's gonna rain Saturday. I'm working tomorrow, but it's Friday. So, yeah. Got that little pocket. Got that little pocket. And I got some mulch to put in the backyard. I'm not showing the backyard because it's under construction. It's a Bermuda lawn in the back. <clears throat> so, yeah. That's it. You got anything to say to the camera, babe? Please like, share, and subscribe to the channel. Right, let us know if y'all have any projects coming up. Alright. I'm still working on it, so he'll probably have more soon. Peace. Thanks for watching.